So this is my desk. Um, over there I have a fan. I have some brushes, my vanity mirror, and then all of this. So you could see me in the mirror, but like just ignore it because right now I look a little bit musty. So um, that's why I'm not showing my face. But let me show you guys. So over here I have a fan because I used to not have a fan in my light fixture um, up there, like where the light is. So I had that one, but now I have one so I don't really use that one, but it's still there. So this is my chair, you could see it through the mirror. I'll show you guys a better like view of it later on. But over here I just have my brushes. I have my face brushes, my eye brushes, and then my everyday brushes. This container I got from Target and as you can see it was $1 from the dollar section. Some brushes I have are from Real Techniques and I also have some BH Cosmetic ones and I have a MAC one right here. And I just have all these random ones. I have a Tarte one as well. If you guys are looking for good brushes, BH Cosmetics has some really good brushes for cheap. So I recommend those ones and also Real Techniques. And I just have more brushes like this. I have this one. I have this one that I don't even know where I got it from. Then I have more over here. This one's from Victoria's Secret. Honestly, I didn't even know I had this one. And this one is just a random brush. This one, another random brush. I just have a lot of random face brushes. This is just all my face brushes. And this one is my eye stuff, and I don't know where I got this one from. It's broken over here, but let's just ignore that. Um, it doesn't say... In the bottom, it doesn't say where it's from, but it does say that it was $6.99, so I got this one. So right here, I just have my eyelash curler, and I don't know where I got this from. Then I have some Real Techniques makeup brushes, some MAC ones. Then I just have this one that I got from a random set. It says Kestrel. And then I have this one from the Dollar Tree. I use this for my face masks, so that's why it's in here. Then I have some B Bella eyebrow brushes and just a lot of random brushes that I have right here. And this thing, I just have some pearls right here that I found at my house and I thought it looked cute so I put it there. This is just a mason jar. It says Curves or something like that. But it's just a jar. It's just a jar that I found at my house so I wanted to use it for just everyday brushes. This one is just from the random brand that I told you guys. I use this one for cream contour sometimes just to apply it on my face. Then I also have just some random brushes. This one is like a blush brush. Then I have over here this BH Cosmetics brush then I have my favorite brush right here this is from BH Cosmetics and I use this one for highlight then I also have this one from BH Cosmetics this one's for my blush as you guys can see I love BH Cosmetics then I just have some Ulta Beauty brushes and just brushes like that so these are my face brushes moving on and over here I just have this mirror that I got from Target I believe like 10 or 20 dollars I clearly need to clean this but I'll do that later then I have this one that I think my mom got it from Ross, um, and I just stole it from her. It has a clear side and then a magnifying side. Dang, these look real dirty. Now I'm going to move on to the top of my desk over there, and then I'll move into this drawer. So over here, I just have my jewelry on this stand, and this stand I got from, I think, Home Goods. And I just have all my jewelry, and over here, you can see my wall socket, or I don't know what that's called. But when I painted my room, I was supposed to paint that white. But my little sister wanted to paint it for me, so I left it like that, and she never painted it for me. So that's why it looks all crusty like that. But let's just ignore it. And over here, I have a Victoria's Secret perfume. It's the Warm and Cozy Chilled. And then if you go down, I just have some loose jewelry that I'm going to buy a box for soon. But I just have it here because I don't know where else to put it. So I just have some earrings, some necklace. That's a necklace that broke. And then like a watch right here and all of that stuff. So now moving back to that drawer. So I'll move this chair out of the way so you guys can see better. But in that drawer, let me open it for you guys. You guys need a better view. Let me adjust it real quick. So in this drawer, I just have my palettes and eyelashes and just stuff like that. So in this corner, I just have this. These are just my glitter, like, liners and stuff. And then over here, I have some loose shadow that I need to buy a palette, like an empty palette for. And then I just have some extra eyelash curler, like, inserts. So when my eyelash curler breaks the little thing, I can have extra ones. And over here, let me just push them up so you guys can see more. Over here I just have my eyelashes and as you guys can see I love the Glam and Glow ones. So this is just how they are and let me see if I have some in here. No. Nope. These are just the Glam and Glow ones that I love so much. These are the pink ones. They look like this. I already worn them before so they look a little bit like used. But they look like this and they look so pretty on the eye. And then there's some black ones and these ones are extremely dramatic. I don't know if you guys can see them but they're super super dramatic. I don't even use these ones. But yeah, so these are my eyelashes. 
Over here I have this Morphe and Kathleen Lives palette that looks like this. Then I have this Morphe palette. This one is the this one is the 35B palette and it looks like this. It's kind of hard to open with my nails, but this is how it looks like. I think it's so pretty. Then I have this Morphe palette. It's one of the older ones and it's and it's 35O. You can barely see it, but sorry for that. So this is how it looks like on the inside. So this is how it looks like on the inside. As you can see, I chipped that one, but that's okay. It's so pretty. Then on this side, I just have these palettes. I have this one from Ulta. Looks like that. Then I have the Butter Me Up palette from Tarte. Looks like this on the inside and it's really cute. Then I have this Tartis Pro Glow palette. Tartis, I don't know how to explain it, Tartoise. It's just the sculpt one, I think. It looks like that. And then over here, of course, I have the James Charles palette. And I actually bought this palette right when it came out with my own money. But this is how it looks. I'm pretty sure everyone already knows how it looks like. And over here, I just have this Christmas. I just have this Christmas Too Faced set. And it came with a mini um, Better Than Sex mascara. But I put it in my mascaras. And these are just the eyeshadow palettes. I'm going to show you guys how they look. It's eyeshadow and face palettes. So this one looks like this. The middle one looks like this, and the big one looks like this. Then over here you can barely see, let me just get them out. Right here on top I have the Too Faced Chocolate Gold Palette. Under that I have the Naked 2 Palette. Then I have these three palettes. This one is an Ulta Palette, you guys can see how it looks already through the clear top. Then I have this palette that my little sister bought me. It looks like that, it's really pretty with pink ones. Then there's new dude palette that my aunt gave me, and it, I use this one a lot. So that's it for this palette drawer. Now let's move on to the Alex drawer. So this is the Alex 5 drawer. I'm just going to show you guys the first one. So I'm going to be sitting in this chair, so sorry if you guys see my pajamas throughout this video, but just ignore that. So this is the first drawer. Right here I just have my concealers. I have a ColourPop one, then I have some NYX ones, the NARS one, this Maybelline one I think. Another NYX one, the LA one, that's too dark for me, then Wet n Wild, and I just have concealers like that. Over here, I have my foundations. I just have this e.l.f. one, then this Stay, Super Stay, CoverGirl one, I think. Oh, it's Maybelline, not CoverGirl. Then I have a Milani one, some random one my mom gave me. Then I have this one and the Burt's Bee one. And most of these are too dark for me because I got them when I used to be darker, but now quarantine made me a little bit lighter. So these really don't match me, but I still have them for when I get darker again. Then over here I have my primers. I just have the e.l.f. one. I have this moisturizer from Clinique, and it's just the mini one that's almost empty. Then I have the baby skin one, some Ulta ones, and then some tinted eye primers, and I also have the e.l.f. eye primer. Over here I just have these bronzers. So this is the Avon one, then I have... Laura Geller one, a Too Faced one, then I have a Tarte one, oh wait, oops. Then I have this Tarte one that I use every single day, well, when I do my makeup, and it just looks like that. You guys can tell that I used the highlighter. I love this highlighter, and this bronzer, well, I use it as a bronzer, it's really good for my skin tone. Then I have the e.l.f. cream contour one that has foundation on the top. Last but not least, in this drawer I have these... I have these face sprays. So I have this one, it's a setting spray. Then I have the mini all-nighter and the Mario Badescu one that's literally empty. So that's it for this drawer, now onto the next one. So in this drawer, I just have this little compartment. And all my compartments I got from Dollar Tree because they were super cheap. So I just have my tools here, my eyelash thing, these little brushes that I have right here. Then I have these, um, these blenders that I got from Real Techniques. Some little tools so I can put my eyelashes on even though I use my fingers. Then I have a little navaja. I don't know how you say it in English. But that's just like to shave your face and stuff. I just have like all my little tools here. Over here. Over here I have like my highlighters and blushes. I have these dandelion one and this gold rush one from Benefit. Then over here I have this elf one. Oh, yeah. Then over here I have this elf one that I heard really good news about it so I got it. I have an Ulta Beauty one. I have some cream highlights. I have some cream highlights. This one is just from Tarte. 
and then I have a wet and wild one down there and an Ulta one over here I have all like my eyeliners mascaras and all of that so I have eyeliner this mascara this one is the best one if you guys are looking to get a cheap drugstore mascara this one's only five dollars and it's really good I prefer this one over the pink one and the purple one then I just have a, a sharpener and then I use this elf pomade it works like the Anastasia one and it's just really good then I have like the elf one and just a lot of mascaras the NYX tinted 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 brow mascara you guys can't really see it but that's how it looks and yeah just like my eye things and over here I have my little powder thing so I have a Sonia Kasu powder I have this Neutrogena one then I have like Make, make, then I have like Makeup Revolution Banana Powder and then this one. I don't know if you guys remember, but Bethany Moda used to always have that one in her videos. So I just remembered and I bought it because I thought, why not give it a try? So that's it for this drawer. Let me move you guys so you guys can see better. So in this drawer, I just have all my lip products. I have these Ulta lip products that I think I want to do a lip swatch video on, but I don't know if a lot of people are going to have these. So they're just the Ulta ones, these are the long ones, these are the short ones, and they're actually really good. Then over here I just have this lip balm. Then I have this, which I have all my Lorac lippies. Where I have all my Lorac liquid lipsticks, and then over here I just have some stick ones. This one is from a One Direction set that I got a long time ago. Then I have some L'Oreal ones. They all fell, oh my gosh. I have some, then I have some Ulta Beauty, and I have a um, MAC, and just random ones like that over here i just have my lip liners and lip glosses i just have a victoria's secret one a clear one and then another victoria's secret one and i just have these liners from the kylie lip kit and ulta last but not least over here in the corner i have these just random ones that i couldn't put in a section i have these stila ones this maybelline one i believe yeah it's maybelline then i have the kylie ones this one's in the shade this one's in the shade coco k then I just have a BH Cosmetics one that I got gifted and also a Tarte one. So these are just the random ones that I couldn't fit in the categories. So that's basically it for my makeup. In this bottom bottom drawer I just have perfumes, some lotion, that's a foot lotion, and then some like bath bombs and stuff. I have my phone case, little gadget things, and then like skincare and more phone cases. And then a portable charger. This is just like a junk or like everything that doesn't fit in anything else drawer down here is like the same thing let me get you guys a better view so i just have a belt right there then over here i have deodorant a sticky note that my mom wrote me when i was in school and i kept it because i thought it was cute i have my eyeglass case and over here i just have some nail polish that i use normally this is not all my nail polishes but it's just a couple then i used to have a flashlight right there and a lighter for emergencies and then under this, so under that I just have my hair things like rubber bands, an extra Tiffany box. I have more skincare and just random things. That's when I used to have a cute bronchite, so they gave me an inhaler, but I don't use it. I don't have asthma or anything like that. I have some eye drops. Over here I have my hair tool. I have my hair tool. And then I just have some hair protectant sprays, a brush, a little thing to put on my hair so my makeup doesn't get in it. And then like some clips for my hair. Then I have that waiver that doesn't work. I don't recommend it. It broke within like the first 10 minutes that I turned it on. So this is the chair that I have. It just looks like this. I think it was like $50 from Ross. And my mom got it again. And I just stole it from her. Like I stole everything from her. So this is my vanity. I hope you guys enjoy. I know I don't have a lot of makeup. I would like to grow it more. That's why I did this tour right now. So that when I get more makeup, I can do an updated one. But yeah, this is just my vanity. I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!